On the brink of the highly anticipated release of her new movie, Love Lies Bleeding, slated to hit theaters in the United States on March 8, Kristen Stewart candidly discusses the entrenched sexism within the film industry, a challenge she has grappled with since the early 2000s when she first stepped into the world of cinema. At 33 years old, Stewart flips the script by taking on the role of a gym owner in the gripping romantic thriller from A24, helmed by director Rose Glass. In the film, her character Lou embarks on a passionate affair with a female bodybuilder, portrayed by Katie O'Brien, and as Stewart puts it in her trademark candor, the storyline starts off with a little shake, but soon it blows up and affects everyone. I can tell you it was incredibly damn fun to give my character, the younger and lesbian sister, the chance to shine as the lead in a film. She never had that opportunity. No one was betting on her. I mean, some would glance her way, but she definitely wasn't in the spotlight. In his piece, journalist Alex Morris depicts how Stewart's rigorous preparation for the role, including intense kickboxing and yoga sessions, has visibly transformed the actress's physique. Kristen Stewart is strong as hell and I'm not just saying that. I'm not referring, for instance, to overcoming any of her past experiences that could be labeled, in quotation marks, as challenges. Like when she faced criticism for her perceived lack of enthusiasm during promotional events for the Twilight Saga or when she was caught kissing the much older and married director of Snow White and the Huntsman, and the fallout led to her being ousted from the sequel. I'm not even talking about the audacity of playing Joan Jett in front of the real Joan Jett, or embodying Princess Diana in front of a global audience, or the courage it took to publicly come out on Saturday Night Live in a direct response to the derogatory comments made by a reality show host turned president. In other words, I'm not talking about strength as the golden narrative reserved for famous women who don't bend to the stereotypes imposed by society. No, I'm talking, quite literally, about Kristen Stewart's biceps. Throughout the interview, the actress also shares her reflections on portraying the iconic Bella Swan in the Twilight series, a role that propelled her to global fame, making her one of the highest paid actresses in Hollywood during the franchise's production years. The images showcase Stewart sporting a mullet hairstyle, dressed in jockstraps and basketball shorts, captured in a style reminiscent of Jeremy Allen White's Calvin Klein campaign rather than the typical bikini-clad covers of Rolling Stone. This unique spread swiftly gained traction on social media, sparking admiration among fans for providing a hypersexualized photoshoot for a queer celebrity that transcends the traditional male gaze.